you know, like for those who know it, Facebook ads objective, we used to have 11, 11 objectives. Now, at this point of time, they are transiting things over. So you might see 11 objectives. You might see, uh, what do we call? Uh, you might see six objectives, you know, like on under my portfolio, I have so many ads accounts. I think about 40% goes to the six objective one and uh, about 60% are still remaining with the 11 objectives. Now, what happened is Facebook is grouping objectives together and uh, put them under more easy, I mean, easier to be an understandable uh, so-called termini terminologies. Like they group uh, messages, uh, lead form and all this together under lead and they group sales. Uh, like for example, they group conversion, catalog sales and messages under sales, which means if you want sales, then you have to go for that. So in fact, it actually created some confusion among people where some people will get like, oh, seriously, now I don't, don't understand sales. So well, what should I do? And in fact, right, once you selected the right thing, the moment you go into that, uh, I would say 95% of the interfaces and everything remains unchanged. However, uh, it also created some bug anyway. So when you first started, when one of my client's account first switched over, a lot of stuff was really haywire. We had to report back to Facebook several times to say, hey, you know, this is not, not right. You know, we, 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 we don't have this. We, we, we can't do this. We have this challenge and all that. So basically, that was what happened. However, based on my observation, if you are worried about whether, like, one of the most commonly asked questions here is, oh, will this new objective lineup affect the algorithm? Like, algorithm, right? Seriously, what algorithm do you refer to? Um, there is no algorithm, basically. Facebook ads is already well-programmed in a way that the moment you tell them what you want, they will find the people who might do what you want. So that's how the whole so-called algorithm works. So as long as you know how to choose the objective correctly, you won't go wrong. All right, that's what I think. Basically, everything starts from understanding what you really want. That's why, I mean, I hate to do this again, but eventually the most classic example is if you want people to go to your website and buy and you bloody go and boost your post, of course, you won't be able to get the people who might do the same thing and you will get a lot of junk likes or junk comments and all that and you will say Facebook ads don't work because, well, it's actually your fault if you look at this because you did not choose the right objective.